Someone else wanting to get into Cyrodiil? Someone else wanting to get into Cyrodiil? Let's speak with the Legionnaire. This border is a restricted entry zone. State your intentions. You and hundreds of others. But I'm not authorized to let just anyone through. Border's locked down. That's that. No two ways about it. No arguing about it either. Those are the rules. You'll either need official papers or some other justification for your passage. Oh, the Archmage of the College of Winterhold? The prestigious magical institution. I think the Synod and the Whispers will want to take a good look at you. Yes, feel free to enter whenever you like. I'll fill in the requisite forms. Understood. Just hold on one moment. Letting someone as distinguished as you through this gate. Hmm. <laughs> Makes a change from all the frustrated traitors and irate mercenaries. It's been a pleasure. Truly. Here's hoping you can do Cyrodiil some good. I'd advise you make your way down to Bruma. I hear they're dealing with a lot of problems down there. The heartland of Tamriel. She's ailing. Maybe beyond saving. But I'm sure you'll take a fair crack at it all the same. Welcome to Cyrodiil. Persuaded him, we threatened him, we even beat him.
Greetings, friend. Greetings. Yes, revelry. We've got lots of fine drink here. Why not partake in some? Oh, really? You're no fun. I guess we'd better find someone else to drink with. Can I help you? My lord, one septim would mean more to me than you could ever know. If I've told you once, I've told you a thousand times. The chapel of St. Martin does not violate the terms of the White Gold Concordance. There is no talus worship going on here. It violates the spirit of the White Gold Concordance. I must urge you to cease and desist at once. Oh? What is the spirit of the White Gold Concordance? The spirit of the White Gold Concordat is that men are not, and can never be, gods. Just as Tiber Septim is not a god, nor is Martin Septim. I heard some bootblack disappeared in the mountains. Rumor has it he ventured too far into some hidden Nordic ruin. No mention of Martin Septim worship, though? I... No, there isn't. I must consult with my superiors. Perhaps we will have to petition for a slight amendment to some unfortunate specific. Needing an in? Go to the general Well, it has a bad reputation. Well deserved. Name Sayanala, Ayanala Darkheart, best archer in Bruma, and perhaps all of Cyrodiil. Svenja and Erenir will talk your ear off about what the Fighters Guild does or doesn't mean to them. But for me, it's simple. To be in the Fighters Guild is to have a chance at true glory. One day, all of Tamriel will sing my name, and it will have all started here. Mm, the coin paid for each job doesn't hurt either. That comes as part of the job. But that's what this is. A job. At the end of the day, if there wasn't a reward for contracts, then none of us would be here. Well, maybe apart from Svenja. Of course it does. Houses don't come cheap, and either does food or mead. This is the city of my ancestors. My family has been here for generations. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Goodbye. Can I help you? Sorry, but we're not looking for new members right now. The Nimini's branch is currently undergoing strict internal reforms. Check back soon, though. It's not something I can discuss with someone outside of the guild. We're trying to increase public awareness, make sure people know who to come to if they want their contracts completed. But we'll need to step up our presence if that's to happen. Here, take these posters. Put them up in prominent positions around the room. Once you've got them all up, return to me, and I'll have some coin waiting for you.
alteration expert, eh? How about you turn my skin to stone? Hello. Excellent. Not exactly usual Fighters Guild work, but critical if we're to grow our services. Unfortunately, the posters probably won't last long. Rough weather. Ah oh well. Here's your coin. Ah, good to see you. Goodbye. Your skin is so pale. Are you ill, or... No. You couldn't be. What now? Greetings, my friend. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the broom. Indeed, this is odd. And you say it just appeared here out of thin air? It isn't mine, that's for sure. Where do you think it came from? What is with this commotion? Where did that come from? He made this mess. That's the thing. We don't know. It just appeared. How do we know? A stranger in there has something Come here. You there. Come here. Don't play ignorant with me. You are involved in this somehow. I mean, really. You expect me to believe that you just happened to randomly walk in just as this statue appeared here? Really? You genuinely have no idea what I'm talking about. Hmm. You may be telling the truth, or you may not be. I suppose we'll just have to wait and see. Well then, I apologize for the inconvenience. Welcome to the Bruma Synod Conclave. Attendant, clean up this mess, would you? And take that statue to the back for examination. Roll with it. Something you need from me? Destruction spells? Uh, no, not really. If you really want to learn, you'd have to join up with us before I can show you what I know. Nobody here is even allowed to teach you the advanced stuff, though. Synod or not, it goes against regulations. Not that I've really reached the advanced stage yet myself, anyway. Until As it is. Mind your step. Good to see you again, friend. What can Ololentius do for you? Goodbye. How can I help? Good day to you, Cadius. Same to you, Jenny. Was there something you needed? I'm curious. What's the status of the situation of Bruin up in Winterfall Cave? The rumors of necromancers there don't seem. I to am be always happy to help. In truth, they might have actually grown worse. As you noticed when walking in. A couple of seemingly random items have been appearing in the Conclave of late, and I'm not quite sure as to why. Given that, as you can no doubt imagine, the Conclave is very busy, I am willing to hire external agents to look into this. After the first item appeared, I had one of the attendants, Attendant Wickart, take it back to the study area for examination. Check with him and see if he has discovered anything. Can I help you? Can I help you? Can I help? 
help you? What is it? Goodbye. How can I help? Anything unusual? Um, well, it's hard to tell, to be honest. I'm not exactly the most experienced mage in this area, but... But... I did notice that it looks an awful lot like an alien design. Haven't you seen the massive statues by the entrances of their ruins? I also know that alien statues this portable and small would be very valuable, and therefore would probably all have been scavenged from the ruins. My theory? I think someone sent it here as a test. Someone who has access to valuable artifacts such as this, that they plan to come get it back. I think someone is going to try teleporting here using the same teleportation uh, er, technique. We should... I'm going to continue studying this thing. You might want to tell Cadius that this doesn't seem to be stopping anytime soon. Something you need from me? What is it? Hello. Have you learned anything more about our little perplexity? Then what are you talking to me for? By the eight. Maybe we can take advantage of this. Search the conclave. Look for anything that seems out of the ordinary and bring it here. Maybe by examining the items, we can determine their origin. What brings you to the Brumus Synod Conclave this fine day? Welcome. What is it? Join the Synod. Hmm. Not right now, citizen. I am afraid we don't have much of an opening in our ranks at the moment. Perhaps check back at a later date. See you. Have you learned anything more about our little perplexity? Give them here. Let's see what they can tell us. Not just any generic form of soul gem. This is a black soul gem. Only two types of people use these. Murderers and necromancers. This certainly isn't an item which carries with it a positive stigma. What else? Fairly common. But it seems familiar for some reason. This almost seems like the type of boot I would wear. Intriguing. What else? A book. Weathered memoirs, eh? This seems to be a journal of some sort about the creation of Frostcrag Spire. 
Well, this is an interesting twist in our little mystery. Before we examine this further, I'd like to see any other artifacts which may have appeared. These told me a lot, thank you. One thing is certain. Whoever these items belong to is affiliated with the magical arts. More specifically, the darker side of the magical arts. It would also seem that our mystery mages have some connection with Frostcrag Spire. Haven't you seen that large tower in the mountains off in the distance? That is Frostcrag. It was supposedly erected back in the late third era by some old mage with too much time on his hands. Quite the sight, isn't it? It would probably still be of great interest to the Synod too, were it not sealed off many years ago by its last residents. I'm not quite sure what part the Spire plays in the summoning of these mysterious objects. Yet. We shall see. We in the Bruma Synod Conclave sincerely appreciate your aid in this matter, simplistic as it may have been. I shall send out a letter to the Synod Council Hall in the Imperial City, asking for a fitting reward for... Wait, what's that? Oh, not again! Thought you could get away, huh? This is madness. I am sick and tired of these intrusions. It would appear that your services are again required before payment can be rendered. I cannot simply step back and allow this to continue. Not now that there is a tangible threat to our hall. I, we, must act. Go to Frostcrack Spire and do whatever is necessary to put an end to these infuriating escapades. I just hope that the college isn't somehow involved in this. The Vines know they live to make trouble for us. citizen. I'm Galloran, Synod Hopeful. If you have any cuts or bruises, I'm Galloran, Synod Hopeful.
Oh there, traveler. What's your business in Frostcrack Spire? Hmm. I suppose this is still a College of Whispers sinusure. Or almost one. Fine. Just ask your questions, then make your way out. We don't need Synod spies or vagabonds roaming around the spire. Yes? What is your business here? As much as I appreciate your enthusiasm, no. In our current state, Frostcrag Spire is still not officially recognized as a proper sinusure. Even if it was, in the sinusure's current state, I do not yet have the power to appoint associates. You may wish to check back at a later date. Once the Imperial Council acknowledges our request, we can always use the members. A Sinusure is a place of magical significance. A headquarters and a research site, all in one. You probably think of it like a sort of... conclave. I can assure you it is not. The Synod have conclaves, based out of the old Mages Guild halls. The College of Whispers have Sinusures, the proper term for any magical hall in place of study. So... Was there anything else? Help? Hmm. Well, since you asked. Possibly. I need someone to fix a mistake a member of my team decided to disrupt our busy schedule with. Unfortunately, none of us has had the time to tend to it as of yet. What say you? Much appreciated. You see, during one of my more <laughs> eccentric members early conjuration experiments she made an error in judgment and attempted a conjuration spell which was beyond her capabilities while she did successfully summon a scout the binding process was flawed and now the spawn is running wild through the gerals last we saw it was headed south toward bold man's respite start there and when you find it, return it to oblivion for me. Now go, and try not to die. This territory belongs to the College of Whispers. What brings you to the... ...top of this frigid mountain? Astor, you have to be more careful. Something about you seems a little... off. I'll be keeping be my calm, distance. Be calm, my dear. Be calm. We don't even know if the thing is sending anything through. We have yet to send anyone to check the destination site. For all we know, a blasted creature could be in pieces all over the Geralds. But a zombie? What if it did go through and somebody gets hurt? We can't have that happen, Aster. We need live tests. What? I see your point. Very well. Put you away. Well, thank you. I just hope it didn't cause too much of a panic over there already. Why the eight? It's freezing up here. Once our business here is concluded, I'm going to request relocation. What? Oh no. I knew the old man should have been more careful in his experiments. Go talk to Astor. He should be able to shed some light on your conclave's little mystery.
rather busy with my work. Try one of the others around here. Do I? Well, maybe it's because I have my hands full trying to help establish a sign ashore atop an oversized frozen rock. Do you think that has anything to do with it? Hmm. So not all wandering vagabonds are as thick as two short planks. Good to know. I commend your ability to comprehend simple verbal arguments. Now be gone. Now. Oh! Oh! I... Ah, oh, fascinating. It works then. Simply wonderful. Why, the spire's portals, of course. You know, the ones I've spent the past few days slaving away at, tweaking, in an attempt to get the damn things to work properly. So, tell me, were the objects intact? What kind of scatterbrained question is that? Of course it has portals. There's one to each of the old mages' guild halls in Cyrodiil's cities. Unfortunately, it seems the passage of time has worn away the enchantments enabling the transfer. That's why I'm up here calibrating the things at all. If we lose those, then we lose yet another potential source of arcane knowledge. Truly. Well, this calls for some celebration. We need to push further. Oh, yes. I think it's time to test this beautiful device out for real. Will you assist me? Without a true test, we will never be able to move forward. It needs to be done if we ever wish to implement our own teleportation platforms in the Sinusures. I doubt the Synod will take too kindly to a Whisper's mage suddenly appearing in their conclave. I knew I could count on you. Follow me. awaits you. What I need is to genuinely test these portals out and get them calibrated. I can't fix a problem I don't know exists after all. First, though, I need you to place a marker at the destination site. This ancient thing is set to send people to the old Bruma Mages Guild, which is now the home of the Synod in Bruma. Here's the beacon. I hid it inside this boot here. Just put it in the main hall. With it in place, I'll hopefully be able to focus the portal's trajectory directly to the beacon's location before you test this thing. Good. I knew I could trust you. The Synod might not like it if they suspect you are helping us out. But you already knew that, so I'll see you back here when you're done. Oh, I almost forgot. And it's not like me to forget, so I'd best tell you before I forget again. Ruma's quite the long walk from here. Excellent question, Carlin. Allow me to tell you. I can teleport you to Bruma. Oh, yes. The glistening frozen city high atop the Gerald Mountains. If my memory serves, and I believe it does. Traditionally, teleportation magic uses a focus. That's what the boot is for. To focus the magic. To make sure we end up precisely where we intend to. It's also why, throughout Tamriel's history, mages have employed mark and recall spells, invocations of divine intervention and the like. However, I believe I perfect... well, nearly perfected... mostly a spell to teleport you to an imprecise location. That means I can teleport you to Bruma with a simple flick of my wrist. Expedite your journey. And a lot of fun on the way, I'd expect. However, as I alluded to, I can't send you to any particular location in Bruma. Imprecise magic. So no direct travel to the Conclave, I'm afraid. Still, 
The theory behind the spell is sound. Mostly, I think. So if you want me to teleport you to Bruma, now, or, well, any time, just let me know. Always a pleasure to help you out, Carl. Steal yourself. This may feel a bit... tingly. All right, here we go. Prepare yourself. Good morning. Is there a reason why you're leaving a boot on the floor? I certainly hope. Hello. rather busy with my work. Try one of the others. I'm not sure if you're aware of this, but the College of Whispers is a very old and well-respected organization. Are you ready for what awaits you? Now that I've made every adjustment I can think of to assure its proper function, I need only one thing. Step onto the teleportation pad. If it works, then not only will you have aided me in this first essential test, you will have stopped any further items from appearing in the conclave. Simply step onto the pad when you're ready. Uh, well, honestly, I'm not certain. I would speculate that your body will be stretched, violently torn apart, and spread across the province. It's also possible that your soul will not remain attached to your body during the transfer, leaving it stranded in some forgotten plane of oblivion. The chances of that happening, though, are infinitesimal. You yourself have seen it work in action. Take this with you. If you make it through in one piece, don't bother returning to me. This'll let me know you made it. So, whenever you're ready... Welcome to Frostcrag. What do you mean, who's Carlin? <laughs> Stop being ridiculous, and let's get back to our research already. Hope to see you again. I still need a test subject for my research. Can I help you? Hello. So far, it seems to have stopped. Let's hope it stays that way. Indeed? What happened? What was causing it? Whisperers. Curse those careless, undisciplined necromancers. This time their experiments endangered my conclave. But I'm curious how you think teleporting through it would have destructed the thing. Still, no zombies, nor any other displaced objects for that matter, have appeared in the Conclave since you left. So I suppose it stands to reason that you are being truthful. Hmm. Well, I suppose we'll see. Your service merits reward. Please, accept this sum of coin from the Synod's coffers. Now, good day to you. Hmm? Until next...
can I help you? Oh, you were the one, eh? I heard about that. Good work. Ah, I suppose you're probing for a reward for your service. Let's see here. Ah, yes. Take this. It's an old dagger my team found in one of the ruins during our journey here. The things are fairly common in alien ruins, so the college won't miss it. Has a nifty enchantment, though. Thanks. What is it? Farewell. No, wait. What did you say? Where are you going? What is it? Hello. Yes? What is your business here? Steal yourself. This may feel a bit too Right. Here we go. Prepare yourself. Thank you. 